Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel, Jack of All Trades NYC. How I get my sun-kissed, no makeup makeup look, and how I do my beachless beach waves. In order to get those effortless beach waves, I'm gonna start by putting my hair in a French braid to let my hair sit while I do my makeup. I'm using this Beach Babe sea salt spray in order to add some texture to my hair that almost resembles some ocean water. Next, I'm prepping my face with a little bit of rose water. And I'm gonna use a dollop of the Water Bomb Skin Prep in order to give my skin a nice dewy finish. bit of this hourglass primer all over my face to kind of fill in some of my larger pores before I begin putting anything else on. I find that I get a really natural glow using the MAC Strobe Cream in Pink Light and I use this all on the high points of my face including my cheekbones, the bridge of my nose, a little bit on my forehead, and sometimes on my cupid's bow. I'm gonna use the tiniest amount of Tarte Shape Tape underneath my eyes just to correct my dark circles, and I'm using a beauty blender to blend out and not be too heavy. I'm using some MAC Studio Face and Body Foundation in order to even out my skin tone just a little bit without being too much. I love this foundation because it gives a nice dewy finish and it's waterproof. I'm lightly dabbing on some of MAC's Next to Nothing pressed powder. I'm using this a little bit underneath my eyes, on top of my eyelids, on my chin, a little bit on my forehead so I don't look too shiny. Lastly on my face, I'm gonna use a Soleil Tan de Chanel with a flat kabuki brush. This is a cream to powder formula which blends really, really nicely. Um, and I like to use this on the high points of my face rather than the low points. Using the low points is going to create more of a sculpted contoured look, but applying the bronzer to the high points is gonna give more of a sun-kissed natural glow. a little bit onto my neck so I don't look like a floating head. Since I'm extra pale, I'm gonna dab a little bit of this Patrick Star Give Me Life bronzing powder. I'm applying this directly over the Soleil Tan de Chanel that I just applied. This is just gonna soften the look a tiny, tiny bit. And using the same kabuki brush without additional foundation, I'm just blending in all of my bronzer. Finishing off my face, I'm gonna use this superb Extra Dimension Highlighter from MAC, and I'm applying this over all of my high points to give myself that extra summer glow. I applied this all over my cheeks from the apples straight back to my cheekbones, the bridge of my nose, as well as my cupid's bow. Using Anastasia's Brow Wiz in Dark Brown, I'm gonna begin by brushing my natural brows up and lightly filling in where I see some bare naked spots just to even out my eyebrows. You'll notice that also I'm brushing my brows in an upward direction when I'm done filling them in. This is going to give a fuller brow look and it's not too sculpted where it looks too harsh. And since we're going for a no makeup makeup look, I am curling my lashes because I'm not about to put some strips on. I'm using some of Buxom's Blackest Black Mascara to shake and shimmy a light layer of mascara on just my top lashes. I happen to like when my lips look a little bit burnt, so I'm using some of this Sugar Rose Lip Balm first, followed by this Dior Lip Maximizer, which I'm just lightly placing on my bottom and top lips just to give a little extra shine. My hair has had quite some time to sit since I was doing my makeup, so I'm just taking my French braid out, giving it a little shake, and I'm gonna put a little bit more of the Beach Babe Sea Salt Spray in my hair for a little bit more added texture. I'm also scrunching up from the bottom so I can get a little bit of a messier but more natural beach wave. 
giving my hair one last tease and toss because the bigger the hair, the better. Like and subscribe to my channel. And as usual, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please feel free to drop a like and comment in the box below. Time I'll see you guys next week.